Hey, you know, I mean, sex is 90% mental. You know what I'm saying? It happens in the brain. We have a certain stroke he, he does, and he, he surprises me every now and with, with a different stroke. The stroke is something that's mental. The IC manual on how to stroke. I mean, you could come in and hit it on a swing. It ain't going to be the stroke. The Heyman Hustle. Who are you voting for in the election? Um. Who are you voting for in the election? I'll say Hillary. Why? Because she's a woman. I would want Hillary to win if Obama wasn't in. But I mean, I'm really listening to Obama. I'm not just going to vote for the man because he's black. I'm sizing dude up. You know, if I change my mind at the last minute, I'll do Obama. But I'm just kind of going back and forth. I think if he's out to clean the image of the United States up, if that's possible, it's a good thing, you know. So I'm going for Obama, you know. I hope he wins. It would be good. You know, I wish they were just a team so I could just vote for both of them at once. I actually probably could get a phone call into the president, you know, from my connections of people that know him. I, I can't I can't talk to Bush. Who the hell can talk to Bush? The f*** out of here. I they, hope. They can take us a nomination. He'll become I vice hope, president. I, I, heard, I heard somewhere down the line that might happen. So I think that's in, like, the perfect world, the ideal world. Bush's father was the Antichrist. I told you that. This is son of a Bush. Y'all should have listened to it. Y'all should have been... Li Go play Public Enemy Records from 92 and y'all would... We wouldn't be where we are today. Trust me. When history is written 50 years from now, right. and they look back and they see the protests of the Vietnam War and Crosby, Stills, Nash, and Young, and, and Bob Dylan sang this, do you think that in history we'll go down to recognize you for your contributions for what you were saying back in 92? I really don't know. I mean, they may stop and say hit the most historic moment in music was when Kanye West said the president don't like black people. I'm like, duh. You know what I'm saying? Did you miss Public Enemy? Did you miss Ice Cube? Did you miss KRS-One and us when we used to yell and scream and curse out the government? So today's new, the new uh, generation, they thought that was political. I'm like, that was pussy. That was nothing. We went hard. Cop Killer was the only record ever banned in the history of the United States of America. They came after me with their guns blazing, but I duck bobbed and weave, and I'm still alive. You know what I'm saying? So that's good action. N now you play a cop on television. Well, you know, I never, I never disliked the police. I just thought I was smarter than the police. You know what I'm saying? I never really had a distaste for the police. I used to break the law, you know? So when I'm breaking the law, I'm out to outsmart the cops, you know? So at that point in my life, the police were the opponent. Now, I'm not breaking the law, so I need them to watch my car. <laughs> you know, I mean, as simple as that. You know, I'm, I, I, I never hated police for any particular reason. That's like being in prison hating the guard. You know, the guard is just doing his job. You don't be mad at him, you know what I'm saying? So I never hated cops. I had a, always had a, a respect for police. You know, I know they trying to do their job. I never loved corrupt cops that are out. You know, I mean, when you see stuff like Fitzer, when you see people that put people in jail break the law, now you're dealing with arch criminals, you know, and I stand on that. My, my ideal world, if Hillary becomes president, you become her fashion consultant. Yes. yes. I would totally hook her up. And ICE can teach Bill the stroke. <laughs> <laughs> the Heyman Hustle.